What's up guys? So today we're doing episode 40 Juan of reading my subscribers Jeeps where my subscribers send in their Jeeps. We just kind of take a look at them, kind of show them off and uh, just kind of give my opinions on them and at the end. So uh, if you want to send in your Jeep, uh, shoot me an email info.kylesvt at gmail.com with the subject rate my Jeep and uh, eventually we'll get to your Jeep. Before we start the video, I kind of wanted to show you guys the Discord server. So anyone who becomes a member of the channel and it's just that little join button in the bottom right corner there. Um, if you join the channel at like the first tier, uh, you get access to the private Discord um, where a bunch of people are in here. Um, we just kind of post pictures of our Jeeps, kind of talk, um, just kind of post random stuff. There's a subcar showcase one where like my buddy here just did some a cool lighting setup to his foreigner, but it's kind of like a extra community. Uh, it helps support me by you guys joining the, uh, the channel and then uh, you guys kind of get a perk that uh, you can come join the Discord, come hang out, come chat with us. And it's got like uh, voice comms and text channels. So just kind of a fun little thing. So I figured I'd, if you guys are interested in kind of supporting the channel and kind of wanted to get in uh, on some of the stuff, figure what I'll let you guys know. So we'll start with uh, Kennedy here. Hey, Kyle. My name is Kennedy. I am a 17 year old female. I have a Periwinkle 5 speed 97 Wrangler. This is my first vehicle. And I plan to keep it forever and continue adding to it. Uh, it was a barn find. It only had 90,000 90, miles on it when I first got it. Uh, first pictures are from when we first found it in the barn to now. I also wanted to add that I just sanded down both mirrors and repainted them black. Love your videos and love how much they've helped me. Well, thanks for watching the channel. Take a gander. All right, here's the barn picture. A legit barn find. Very cool. Nice. Like the white wall tire, spare tire in the back. Interior looks clean. That's nice. Very cool. Nice. Wheels and tire upgrade. Very good. Looks good. I like that. Definitely like that you painted the, the mirrors black. That definitely looks, looks probably looks a lot better now. Very nice. Um, things I'd probably change in the Jeep. Um, looks like your fenders could need some love. So maybe some of that uh, ammo pro frame trim coat to kind of bring those back or maybe paint them. Oh, that could work too. So that way they're not so gray and faded looking. Uh, and then I'd probably pull off your little uh, uh, corner caps on the bumper there. Kind of give the TJ, the front bumper, a little bit better look. And then uh, I always recommend getting some LEDs. Um, you can see better. I think they look a little bit better. And then black out those trim rings and then the actual ring that holds it in. Uh, but other than that, the Jeep looks really nice. The wheels and tires look great. You did a nice job compared to uh, when you got it. It was kind of like my Jeep, kind of ugly. Uh, when you first get them, but nice simple wheels and tires make it look really nice. So very cool. Thanks for sending me your Jeep, Kennedy. Like Jose here. I sent to you my Jeep about a year and a half ago when I first picked it up. Uh, here are the mods I've done to it uh, over that time. Old man emu, two and a half inch lift with Rancho shocks, uh, one and a quarter inch body lift, hood louver, aluminum uh, hood latches, W bumper uh, with winch, DJ drop down tailgate. Savvy LED lights, LED uh, headlights, a front anti-rock interior soundproofing with bed rug, uh, repowder coated original Mopar rock rails. Still working on the progress, but I love how it's coming along and driving. Let's take a gander. Let me know what you think, bro. All right, so this is what it looked like before. Now it's now very nice. Like the wheels and tires, like the uh, rock guard there. It looks good. Very cool. Love the louver setup with the nice LEDs and the blocked out trims. Kind of looks like my Jeep. Very cool. Little CJ style door. That's kind of neat. Like thicker carpet. Very cool. Nice. Yeah, I definitely like what you did to it. Um, wheels and tires. The KO2s are great. Are great looking tire. But, uh, but yeah, and it looks like you added a soft top. Very nice. Looks great, dude. Um, I don't really think I'd change a whole lot on the Jeep. I prefer to have uh, like a tire uh, carrier set up. So maybe like a rear bumper of the tire carrier and a spare would look a little bit better uh, on there. And then you could still utilize the, the stock or the CJ style tailgate, but that's very cool. Very nice. Yeah, I don't think I'd really do much else. So thanks for sending me your Jeep, man. Got Arthur here. Hey Kyle, this is my 2006 LJ and 2016 Jeep JK Willis. I enjoy your videos and have found it very helpful with mods and general upkeep. Thank you for all the help and keep up the good work. Thanks, dude. Take a look at your LJ. Very nice. We got some metal cloaks. Very good. Nice. Probably got some LEDs. Very cool. There's your JK. Nice. Dig the front stinger. That looks good with the uh, the metal cloaks. Of course, it looks great. Um, not a big fan of the the lower uh, hanging side steps, but. 
when people need them to get in, but uh, I think they look better without it. Kind of gives the Jeep a little bit more of a raised look too. But uh, yeah, very clean. I like silver. Uh, silver and white TJs look really nice, really clean. But uh, yeah, looks great. The LJ looks great. JK looks nice. I really dig the uh, the Willis and the Rubicon. I think have the same wheels on the JKs. I think those look good. Looks like you're going to be needing some new tires soon. <laughs> Maybe some KO2s. Those would look nice. But uh, I like the, uh, the the stock JK, like the Rock Guard or whatever. It looks good too. Not a big fan of the Angry Girls. I'm not a big fan, but if you like them, definitely obviously keep them. Um, but yeah, looks like looks like two fun Jeeps though. Very cool. Thanks for sending me your Jeeps, man. All right, we got Devin here. Hi, Kyle. This is my 04 DTJ 2.4 liter 5 speed. First picture is when I first got it, and the last picture is the most recent. Let's take a look. Nice. Orange. You don't see orange too often. Very cool. All right, see what you did to it. Very nice. Very cool. That that pink color is really neat, though. Um, things I would do. Um, I'm not a, I'm not a big chrome guy, so I would probably pull these uh pull these chrome inserts out. They just they'll just like little inserts. You can pop them right out. I'd probably pop those out and then black out the your trim rings and then the little uh chrome chrome uh, hood latches too. Uh, cause your bumper is black and that looks nice. And your side rail, I like that too. That's black. I dig your fenders. I think you could use a little bit uh, wider wheel and tire to kind of poke it out just a little bit more kind of not have the jeep so like kind of tuck the tire so tucked under um so you know when those tires wear out or if you got some extra money to buy some wheels and tires i think that would look really good on the jeep um but uh other than that the jeep looks great very cool man those are just some simple things i would change on it but oh, overall so it's a good start so thanks for sending me your jeep man all right we got carson here hey kyle love the channel man keep up the grind thank you dude uh, I'm 17 and this is my 98 Wrangler Sport. I threw in one picture when I first got it and have done several things since. 35 Mastercraft uh, mud terrain tires, matte black 15 inch Pro Comp wheels, kicker sub and speakers all around, fishbone off road front bumper, Terraflex steering stabilizer, Magnaflow exhaust, very nice, blocked out trim rings, very good. And silver, all the small things. Looking to get maybe a rough country uh, black winch with synthetic rope. I do. I like the synthetic ropes. Those look great. Uh, soon, but I don't know if I should keep the front bumper kind of simple like yours. Um, like you have yours. Uh, let me know what you think. And any other mods you think I should add to make it look better. All right, let's take a gander. I think this is when you got it. Or it's now. I think this is when you got it. Okay, so this is when you got it. Very nice really like your wheel and tire choice over the over this style um this looks really good glad you took the side steps off kind of makes the jeep look definitely way better but uh yeah very nice looking looks great um i dig the uh, a pillar lights i would like to get some a pillar lights on my jeep i think these look really cool um yeah i do like your the sim the simple front bumper i think uh i don't know if you can add a winch to that or not if you if there's a spot for winch definitely like just a small little black uh winch would look good eventually i'll get a winch for mine um but it's kind of one of those mods that'll be mainly more for looks than anything so i haven't spent the like you know six or seven hundred bucks on a winch but uh well yeah uh other than that i you already got the leds in the in the uh in the jeep with the black trim rings the front bumper looks great love your wheels and tires they look fantastic the stock tj fenders look great uh, the soft top looks really nice. You got those A-pillar lights. Um, yeah, I really don't think I'd change a whole lot in your Jeep, man. Looks really good. You did a nice job. Very cool. Thanks for sending it in, brother. All right, we'll do one more here. We got Evan here. Hey, Kyle. Just wanted to start by saying that I'm a huge fan of your channel. Well, thank you, dude. That, I appreciate that. I uh, started watching almost two years ago. Wow. And when I got uh, when I got my almost bone stock 2.5 liter at 16. Very cool. Uh, this thing has kept me very busy for the last two years with mobs, problems, and you know, Jeep things. Yep. <laughs> In the future, I plan to swap the 2.5 liter for a built 289 uh, small block from a 66 Mustang, as well as axle swaps. Very cool. So far, I have modded my Jeep with a uh, 4 inch Rough Country lift, 15 by 10 inch fuel wheels, 35s, very nice, barricade bumpers front and rear, uh, Rough Country top, Rough Country winch, headlights, and dual 10 inch subwoofer. Very nice. Uh, there are several things uh, probably slipping my mind, uh, but some pictures will probably help you see the vision. Let's take a gander. 
All right, so I'm guessing this is when you got it stock. I already love the color to start. Excellent wheels and tires. Looks great. Yep. Very nice. Love that it's a soft top with the half doors. Yeah, white. White's definitely my favorite color uh, for the TJs. But uh, very nice. Yeah, I dig your front bumper setup. It's uh, not too crazy. It's got a little bit of a stinger on it. Uh, that looks good. Um, I'd probably, like I kind of tell everyone, LED headlamps, black out the trim rings. Um, but other than that, I mean, even the stock TJ fenders look great on it. Um, yeah, looks good. I really don't think. Oh, we got some more. We got one more here. There we go. Yeah, the great looking Jeep. I really like the stance on it. Not too lifted, but you got it lifted a little bit with the big tires. Really cool looking. So, yeah. Well, here we got another one here. Yeah, awesome looking Jeep, man. Really like it. Um, I don't really think I'd change a whole lot on it just by adding those LEDs. Um, and then you already got the wheels and tires that look great. But, uh, but yeah, I don't think I'd do anything else to it. Looks great, dude. So thanks for sending it in. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for episode uh, 41. Uh, like I said in the beginning of the video, if you guys want to send in your Jeep, info.kylesvt at gmail.com with the subject, rate my Jeep, and uh, eventually we'll get to your Jeep. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Uh, definitely consider subscribing. It helps me out a bunch. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.